Why did the world's richest man, who is obsessed with space travel and colonizing Mars, suddenly buy Twitter? Ever since Elon Musk walked into Twitter's headquarters with a sink in his hands, the social media company has only been a factor of headlines. Former President Donald Trump's account has been reinstated. Much of the management has been fired. Some controversial Twitter files have been exposed. And according to Elon, the freedom of speech has been restored. But what if I told you that Elon has way bigger plans? What if I told you that his Twitter deal was about introducing a crypto payment system for Twitter from the beginning? Wait, what? Crypto? Would make sense to integrate payments into Twitter so that it's easy to send money back and forth. Elon Musk has never been a stranger to crypto. In fact, he has always been a supporter of the decentralized revolution. But hey, didn't he just sell most of his Bitcoin holdings? As a matter of fact, he got out of his Bitcoin holdings would be a better way to say it. A smart move after all, because it only went down afterward. Um, in general, I'm a supporter of, of Bitcoin um, and uh, the idea of cryptocurrency in general. Um, uh, but as I've said publicly, we, we need to watch, to watch out for uh, crypto taking uh, especially Bitcoin, using proof of work to maybe use energy that's maybe a bit too much uh, and, and not necessarily uh, good for the environment. So, um, but on balance, I support Bitcoin and, I, I, and I'm not an investor. I don't, the only publicly traded stock I own is Tesla. Um, and the only significant thing I own outside of Tesla is, is, is my SpaceX stock that, that, that um, you know, help create both companies. So, um, but, out, but apart from that, uh, I do own Bitcoin uh, and, and Tesla owns, owns Bitcoin, SpaceX owns Bitcoin. Um, and I do personally uh, own a bit of Ethereum and, and Dogecoin, of course. If you heard, he pointed out issues like energy usage and environmental impact. And here is one other major one he points out. Uh, it uh, moves quite slowly in reality. It may seem to move fast sometimes, and it does with PayPal, which is real time. But uh, the vast majority of the systems out there are batch processing. So the actual uh, reconciliation may take uh, one to five uh, business days. This is where the XRP comes into the game. Ripple's cryptocurrency is energy efficient, environmentally friendly, and faster than Bitcoin. While it may take up to 600 seconds to process a Bitcoin transaction, it only takes three to five seconds with XRP. And although Bitcoin uses a whopping 57 billion kilowatts per hour of energy, XRP only uses around 475,000 kilowatts per hour. Rumors have been around and leaks have been coming out about Elon's supposed payment system introduction to Twitter. In fact, it's reported that he had said that crypto is a critical area for Twitter. As for Elon, he is not an amateur in payment systems. As one of the pioneers behind PayPal, one of the most successful fintech companies of all time, I'm pretty sure he got incredible plans for XRP and Twitter. And as it turns out, Many experts in the blockchain industry and cryptos agree. Listen to what Blockchain Association Executive Director Kristen Smith has to say about Twitter's entry into crypto. What do you make of Elon Musk's influence on the crypto community and how that could influence Twitter? Yeah, these are all great questions, Emily. I think Elon Musk's um, news about him taking such a large stake and joining the board of Twitter is very important. I think I think one of the reasons is he really truly understands the value of cryptocurrency, whether it be uh, you know Bitcoin or Dogecoin. Uh, he has an, he knows the value of open source networks, and he knows the value when you have many multiple minds thinking and building on how to create a better network. That's very different than a centralized company like Twitter. Um, so what I think is gonna be interesting is, is he going to bring these elements of the crypto world, these anti-censorship elements, the open source elements, and allow for a way for new people to come in and maybe import their own algorithm that could potentially go through and sort the news in the way that they want to be seen, not in the way that Twitter is dictating that it be seen. So I do think there is a potential for innovation here. And, you know, given that, you know, we represent the uh, crypto industry at the Blockchain Association, um, we're hopeful that that by, you know, bringing in this kind of mindset that there will be new ways to to 
uh, get this platform um, to a place that serves more more of its users um, because it certainly is an incredibly powerful platform and I would argue probably the most powerful platform for uh, sharing and receiving information. One thing is clear though, it all goes according to the plan. Anyone who holds XRP will certainly become millionaires overnight as the prices will go beyond the moon and the digital revolution of decentralizing currency will reach a whole different level. So what do you think? Do you see it in any other way? What are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments down below and don't forget to subscribe and keep in touch. I'll see you soon in the next one.